Anthony, that's correct. That restoration work continues. In fact, behind me, you can see the balustrade. The work is going on there, should be completed this summer. What's already been completed is the restoration of those precious documents that were buried here in the park in a box in a vault. Memorial Park was built in 1924 to honor Floridians who died in World War I. It is anybody who served, who, was in, who lived in Florida, is part of this. It's been a focal point in the Riverside community, a place of fun and pleasure. But in 2017, Hurricane Irma's storm surge changed the look of the park, shifted the balustrade, it left the iconic sculpture underwater. There was damage above and below. Kate Halleck is with the Memorial Park Association. So the damage below turned out to be the vault where the scrolls were buried back in 1924 when the park was opened. Scrolls with the names of the veterans, one woman, 1,219 men. A year after Irma, 2018, they decided to open the vault and discovered the reach of Irma. But one of the uh, firefighters with JFRD, Jack is his name, um, said he lifted the box, shook it, and it, looks, it felt like a baseball inside a shoebox, so he knew it wasn't going to be pretty. And that meant that the scrolls had gotten wet and had formed a big ball. To salvage history, the scrolls were taken to the Lighthouse Archaeological Maritime in St. Augustine, and Siebert, a paper conservator, saved the documents. Oh my goodness, it took them about two months of work, about eight weeks of work to do that. They're now in the public library between sheets of glass and will be on exhibit in the Mosh this November. Work on the balustrade will be completed this summer. Halleck says the park is back and it's bigger and better. Now the association is about uh, excited about the upcoming exhibit again, which will be this November. And at that time, they plan to add about 700 and 60 more names of Floridians who died in World War I, names that were discovered after nearly three years of research. Back to you.